what was your message to, to Herman and everybody just kind of make this, put this in motion? Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, I've known Jack since he was 13. I knew he was Jackie Jones, not Jack Jack. So, uh, man, look, good kid that I coached, obviously, for two years. He played with my son, played with Kobe. I coached him. Uh, you guys are in. Uh, I know him inside and out, know the family. I know everything about him. When he was at SC, you know, I was at Poly, kept in touch and contact with him. And then, obviously, when things went, you know, sour with him there, you know, we, we, again, we stayed in touch and just try to help, you know, try to be a mentor. And obviously, there's an opportunity there for both of us to, you know, Kind of team back up again, and I, and I brought my my version of the Jackie Jones I know, you know, and, and knowing the kind of man that we have here and the support staff we have from our AD to the president and, and then the guys you see on the staff, I, I knew we could make it work. Were you, at, at, when it first happened, were you optimistic or did you know there'd be some work to make it happen? Oh, no, I mean, he had work to do. There was no need to talk. He, you know, he had to basically get an AA in one year, you know, he had to do his schoolwork and handle all that. And, Obviously, there wasn't no need to talk until he handled his business academically. And then once he got right there, it was like, all right, hey, this is this can really happen. Do you be listening to change of scenery, really to get on the right track? Do, is that, what, that how you look at this? Yeah, I, I think, again, I think it's, it's who these kids are surrounded by, these student athletes. It's about the men that are, are in their lives who, and what's the purpose those men have for dealing with these student athletes. And I think we have the, the coaching staff and support staff for a guy like Jack to make him succeed. His relationship with Kobe Williams, did that play a big factor, you think? Yeah, because him and Kobe, you know, they came in the poly as freshmen. They played four years together. Uh, obviously, Jack was a bigger name back then. And now Kobe's made his name here. So it's, it's, it's crazy how the, the world works. But, you know, not just that, just having all these guys here from poly and then myself. And then <clears throat> when I was on ESPN, guess who I worked with? Herm Edwards. So when I would talk about ESPN, who did I talk about? Herm Edwards. So that's his head coach now. So you go from one guy as the head coach to another. It all makes sense.